Point. A. C. D. On a circle. We have know the value of segment AB is 2 times square root of 2. BC is 6. And CD is 3. Angle B is 45 degrees. Angle C is a right angle. So, what's the value of radius? Firstly, let's check this diagram. Angle C is a right angle. From Thales' theorem, we know diameter suntens right angle on the circle. If we extended CB to the circle and intersect on point E, then connect DE. DE is diameter of the circle. So if we get the value of EC, we can get the diameter of the circle by Pythagorean theorem. So we can get the radius of the circle because DE equal 2 times radius. Let's go back to the problem. Through point A, make a perpendicular segment to CE. Intersect CE on point F. Intersect the circle at point G. Let's focus on triangle ABF. From 45 90 degree theorem, we'll get AF equal to BF is 2. CF is equal to 4. Then through point D, make a perpendicular segment to AG. Intersect at point H. Let's focus on FCDH. It is a rectangle. So, FH equals to CD equals to 3. Through central point, make a perpendicular segment to CD and EG. From chord perpendicular diagram theorem, we can get CD is divided equally by the perpendicular segment. such as AG also divided equally by the segment. We can calculate HG equal to 2. FG equal to 5. After get FG equal to 5.
from Cord's product theorem. We can get the equation of EF. EF is equal to 2.5. So we get EC equal to 6.5. DE is diameter of circle. DE equal to 2 times radius. So we get equation for radius. Radius equal to 3.58. Thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to thumbs up and click the subscribe button if you don't subscribe my channel now. You will not miss my future videos. See you next time.